Hi first graders, welcome to unit four, week five, day five. Okay, so we're going to start off by um, changing the letter, changing the sound to make a new word. So let's start. Jelly, change the j to b. Belly, get rid of the e. So that'd be bell. Change the e eh to i. Bill, change the b to ch. Chill. Add an E at the end, chilly. Change the ch to h, hilly. Change the i to a, holly. Change the h to d, dolly. Change, uh, get rid of the E, doll. Change the a to a, dull. Change the o to mp, dump. Change the d to b, bump. And then add an E at the end. Bum, B. Change the B to Gr. Grumpy. Okay, friends. So because this is our fifth day, I'll give you three seconds. Uh, and then I'll say the word. Hopefully you can do it in your head without making the sound. If you can't, that's okay. Um, just keep, tr keep trying, keep practicing, and you'll get better at it, okay? If you need to make the sounds, that's okay too. Three, two, one baby three two one city three two one valley three two one bathtub three two one teapot three two one funny three two one key three two one volley three two one seashell three two one daylight Three, two, one, really. Three, two, one, puppy. Three, two, one, misty. Three, two, one, penny. Three, two, one, honey. Three, two, one, musty. So if something is like musty, it, it's kind of, it has a particular smell, kind of. That's kind of a tricky one to explain. Three, two, one, sunrise. Three, two, one, notebook. Three, two, one, kitty. Three, two, one, messy. Three, two, one, monkey. Three, two, one, football. And three, two, one, ant hill. Okay, here are our words. Here we go. Found, 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 found. We found our lost dog. Hard, 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 hard. It is not hard to write your name. Write, 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 write. It is not hard to write your name. Woman, 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 woman. That woman lives near the school. Near, 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 near. That woman lives near the school. Wood, 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 wood. Would you like to play with us? And our um, next part is compound words. So remember, two words stuck together to make a new word. Okay, here we go. Bed time. Bed time. Bedtime. Next, snow man. Snow man. And you go this way. Snow man. Snow man. Back pack. Back pack. Backpack. Cup, cake, cup, cake, cupcake. Hill, top, hill, top, hill, top. Rain, coat, rain, coat, rain, coat. Okay, our next one, um, our last page is on adverbs. So remember, adverbs tell us when something happens. So I'll read. Um, the first sentence to hear, and I'll give you three seconds to think of the adverb. I have to give my dog a bath today. Three, two, one. If you said today, today is our adverb. Okay, so I'm going right to here for my next sentence. First, I get out the hose, soap, and a brush. Three, two, one. First, my adverb is first today. Okay, then I'm going right here. 
Next, I get my dad. Three, two, one. Next would be my adverb because it tells me what I'm doing next. Okay, and then we're on the last sentence. He always holds the dog while I wash. That one's a little bit trickier. Three, two, one. Always. So if you said always, that's correct. Always um, tells about a time because it's always happening. Happening all the time. Okay, everyone. I hope that helped. I will see you next week. Bye.